What is up everyone, Watering Grass here, and welcome to my second Wild Blaze booster box. If you have not seen the first one, which is the first Japanese booster box I ever opened, go check it out. It was absolutely awesome, and it was a lot of fun to open. In one second, I gotta go close my computer before it dies. <laughs> Alright, sorry about that, but... Uh, in this one, we're going to open up a second uh, Wild Blaze box. We got some amazing pulls from that first one. I was very excited. So uh, let's hope that continues with this second one. Now, these are a lot of fun to open up. If I can, you know, open it up. All right, where's my knife? Got to keep a knife on hand, guys. You never know who's going to come in your house and attack you. I'm just kidding. Besides, I don't need a knife anyway. But anyway, let's get this open. Jesus, what is up with this plastic? There we go. I didn't want to damage the box, so I was trying to take it easy. So if you guys haven't seen the box in my first video or anyone else's videos, I'm sure many people have opened this before, you guys can get a quick look at it all right now. There it is right there, and let's get it open and then go through these packs. So, do the little box trick thingy right here. Give it a nice display. There we go, and move these little flaps to the side and start opening it. So we got 20 packs. Let's just keep the luck rolling like we had last time. Hoping for a um, full art in one of these boxes. So we'll start things off with a magnetic storm. Very cool indeed. Always nice to see Japanese guards. A Dusclops. See that? A uh, Helioptile. And a Golem. Very nice. Golem is a very cool Pokemon. I always like Golem. Uh, next up, we have another pack. I keep wanting to say that there's different pack arts, but there's not. They're all Mega Charizard X. <laughs> that card up front, and we start things off with a Skunk Tank. A Durant, so two rares back to back. This was English. Sentret, Feebass, and. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Oh, that is awesome. Another Charizard EX. We actually already pulled one of these, but I don't mind at all because that is an awesome, awesome, awesome EX to pull. That is fantastic. All right, where's the other one? There it is, right here. So we got two of them. So that's very cool indeed. Another Charizard EX, that is awesome. You cannot complain when you pull a Charizard EX, you just can't do it. Because even if you don't like Charizard, a lot of other people do. So, you know, it's good trade fodder, but I'm, I've grown quite a keen to Charizard lately. I always used to didn't really like Charizard that much. I was always more of a Blastoise and Venusaur kind of guy. I don't have a Charizard. I did start, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you, in, uh, when I had first bought Pokemon Blue, when I first got it, my starter was Charmander, and I did love that Charizard, but ever since then, Charizard just became, I don't know, like overrated to me. I don't know, it turned me off, but now I'm starting to really like Charizard again. Um, all that old nostalgia coming back, Geodude, and that intense looking Walrein. Another pack. These Japanese packs, they do rip open. Um, if you want to conserve them, I suggest scissors or taking your time to opening them. But we're just tearing through them. Here is a Roserade, a Love Disc, Stunky, Caterpie, and a Pokemon Center Lady. Maybe we'll pull that in Japanese. That'll be fancy. So we already had a great pull out of this box. That beautiful Charizard EX. Of course, you're guaranteed EXs in a box, but you know, it's still always such a surprise when you pull one. And you don't know how many you're going to pull. So there's a Barbarical, a Weasel, a beautiful looking Pidgey. Esper and Startling Megaphone! At least that's what it's called in English. <laughs> I love the eyes, how they're glowing red on this Charizard pack art. It looks amazing. The artwork is incredible on these pack arts. I like the artwork on the English sets, but I have to say the Japanese artwork is a hell of a lot better. Even though it is more variety with English packs. Look at, I mean, look at the difference. <laughs> we got a Lysander, a Nuzleaf, a Flabebe. Shinx and a Pidgeot. Not bad, not bad at all. Next up, guess what, guys? Another Charizard pack. <laughs> Besides, I really like Mega Charizard X. I think it's awesome. <laughs> but there's a Fiery Torch. Who doesn't think Mega Charizard X is awesome? A Sneasel, Duskull, Litleo, and a Floatzel. So things have slowed down since that EX. Not even a Hollow. Maybe there'll be one in this pack. There should be. We can hope. We have a drag algae. The dragon made of algae. <laughs> a Maractus, Binacle, Quillfish, and there we go. There's a hollow. And a hollow that I like 
quite a bit. Heliop tile right there. Very, 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 very nice indeed. Indeed, indeed, indeed. So there we go. Back on track. Here's another pack. Hey, look, that rhymed. I'm a poet and I didn't even know it. <laughs> so like I said, I do have a lot of Rising Fist booster boxes coming in. I got about three as well as uh, some of those uh, like Kalucha EX boxes to open up. So I'm excited to get those open. I'm excited for the uh, Rising Fist box. I'm definitely excited for when it comes out in August in English. But there's a Pokemon fan club, a Skrelp. A Sfeel, a Luxio, and Gudra! Gudra Hollow. So back to back Hollows. And that's a fantastic Hollow to pull to. Gudra's a cool Pokemon. Cool Pokemon indeed. I like how it's a different concept than most other dragons. I really do. And it's a pain in the ass to battle against, to be honest. <laughs> uh, insert card. I almost said Go Guard. And we have a Luxray. Very nice indeed. A Bergmite. A C Dot. A Pony Dot. And. Oh! Oh, a full art! Ooh, that's a glossy, glossy full art. A Magnezone EX full art. That is incredible right there. Not expecting that um, at all. It's not a Charizard EX full art, but it's still a beautiful full art. Look how... That is such a nice freaking card. Woo! Full art right there. That is awesome. Full art Magnezone EX. This box has definitely redeemed itself in the last few packs. <laughs> we still have uh, about half to go, so let's just keep it rolling, rolling, rolling. Beautiful full art right there. Very, very nice. Very nice indeed. We have a Sacred Ash in this pack to start things off. A Helioptile, a Centret, a Fluet, and oh, back to back EXs? What? Kangaskhan EX. We actually pulled one of these already too, but I am not complaining. This is a beautiful EX card. So back to back EXs, a full art, and then a Kangaskhan EX after two hollows. So, very cool. Very, very, very cool. How many more packs do we have left? This this, this box might end up being one of those boxes where there's a lot of, uh, a lot of EXs. So, we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we got nine packs to open up still. Uh, we should be able to pull more hollows. And maybe we'll pull one more EX. Who knows? Who knows, guys? We'll find out. Insert card. And I almost didn't do the little trick thingy. But there's a Rapidash. Majestic Rapidash. A Feebas. Gumi. A Celio and a powerful, powerful friends, Miltank. Next pack. So I'm very excited to open up the uh, Rising Fist. I love Rising Fist. I just, I, I mean, I'm looking at the set and all that on uh, Poke Beach, and it's just an amazing set. I need to get my hands on one of those Lucario EX full arts. Um, Geodude, Stunky, Sligoo, and uh, there we go. I told you we were due for some hollows. There's a Melodic Hollow right there. Very nice indeed. I'm not sure what the hollows are in this set. I know what they are in uh, English, but in Japanese, not so much. Let's see what we can get out of here. We got a Avalug, a uh, Caterpie. Why can't I think of Caterpie for a second? Pidgey, Roselia, and oh, that's not a hollow in English, but it's a beautiful hollow in Japanese. There we go. Meow stick right there. Very, very, very nice hollow. Very nice indeed. So, next up, we got another pack. Let's see if we can get out of this one. There's the insert card. Got a Skunk Tank. An Esper. A uh, Flabebe. Baneri. And a Protection Cube. Or the All Spark. I mean, if you're a Transformers fan, that's what that is. <laughs> Let's see what we get out of this pack. I'm still pulling for one more EX. If not, I mean, we did pull a full art. We cannot complain about that. We got a, a Fortress. A Shinx, and we got a hold on the box to open up. Duskull, Pidgeotto, and <laughs> if you call, you shall receive. There is another EX. Four EXs from this box, including a full art. That is awesome. And this is an EX that we haven't pulled in English or Japanese yet. And honestly, my favorite EX from the set is Toxicroak EX full art. And there it is right there, Toxicroak EX. Oh, wow, that's beautiful. We'll do a little recap at the end. We got... Uh, three more packs to open, four more packs to open up. So we're going to do a little cutting video right here because my camera only records in HD for 10 minutes. And then i got to cut it anyway. So you guys won't even notice. See? Told you guys you didn't notice. Four more packs to open up for this part, this box. Let's see what we can get. We already got four freaking EXs from this box. That is an epic box if you ask me. But there is a Barbarical. A Litleo. A Vinicle. A Panko. And a Butterfree. But a free! Next back. 
Now, I do do all these videos in succession, so if I ever seem out of breath at any point in the video, it's because I have not stopped talking for at least two hours. There's a trick shovel, a scrap, sfeel, graveler, and nice, another hollow. There we go. Dusk Nor hollow right there. And it's a beautiful one to pull. And we got two more packs to open up. Not really expecting much out of these two packs, because we did pull four yeses already, including a full art. And we already got a good number of hollows, but we're still going to open them up anyway, just to see inside. This is my first ever Japanese opening, so of course we're going to go all out. There's a Magnetic Storm, Bergmite, Metapod. Dusclops and a Weavile. So some cool Pokemon in that pack at least. And the last pack of this epic, epic 4EX box. Let's see what we can pull. Let's go for one more holo. Why the hell not? We have a Pidgeot, a Seedot, a Helioptile, a Durant, and <laughs> asking you shall receive. There is a Florges holo. So we got some amazing pulls from this part, uh, this box. Let's recap them really quickly, shall we? Shall we? Put them in ultra, uh, you know. We got one, two, three, four, five, six. We got ten. Ten seems to be the number. So there is a Florgis Hollow. It's beautiful. That Florgis is gorgeous. There's a Dusknor. Feel focus on Dusknor. Doesn't want to focus on Dusknor. There's a Meowstic. Maybe it's scared of Dusknor. A Melotic. A uh, Gudra. Gudra. And a Helioptile, which is my favorite Hollow from the set by far. By far. Then we got four EXs from this box. Four awesome EXs. We got Kangaskhan EX. We also have a Toxicroak EX, which I'm very excited to pull. Another Charizard EX. That's awesome. And the best pull, obviously, of this box was a Magnezone EX Full Art. Very nice card indeed. I hope you guys enjoyed this box opening. Stay tuned for the final one. And then we're going to open up some uh, Halucha EX boxes as well as some uh, Rising Fist boxes coming up that should be at my house by Monday. And it is uh, Friday afternoon right now. So thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned for more to come. Let's get this video up to 100 likes for my first ever Japanese full art pull. And I will see you all in the next video. Have a great night. Have a great day wherever you are in the world. Watering grass. And I am out. Later.